No, this is this is how you don't play hard. Yeah, probably. When you last left our hero, I I managed to run up over a hundred bucks on um, wanted ads or I'm wanted or some shit. I don't have a lot of money. Oh, it's dark already. I hate that. I should go to sleep. Where's my horse? 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 There you go, horse. How you doing, everybody? Mm. I can't sleep. Nobody's home. I'm bored out of my brains. So, figure I'd do this here. Uh, this is what I can't seem to do. Uh, can't seem to sleep. So, no soccer. Probably do. You know, I'm a little burned out. A little burned out there, you know. Let's see. Uh, uh, yeah, let's cook this shit. A little burned out. I went to a game today. I watched the big game today. And um, I, I just, I, I think I've had it. I watched it. I went to... Uh, Wiesbaden, we lost to the worst team in the league. Um, it was really just pathetic to watch. So no, no soccer, no football for me. I'm kind of, I need a break. And I was going to do a, a watch along and I was so tired at the time. That's probably why I can't sleep. Uh, my partner, English Nick, uh, he said he had forgotten it. And I was like, you know what? I'm glad you forgot it because I am beat. So I canceled the stream and I took a nap. Um, so there you go. Have you ever played soccer yourself in high school and uni? Um, no, I quit playing soccer when I was 13, when I was first al allowed to. Um, I've always had a bit of a love-hate relationship with the game. You know, I didn't grow up in a time where there was no Landon Donovans and they're all younger than I am. Um, there was nothing cool about it. There's no celebrities you knew in the States. Like the only guy I knew is like France Beckenbauer and Pele. And they weren't exactly on TV all the time. Um, so that's a big NO. I did play. I didn't really enjoy it when I played. I started getting into it when the World Cup came around, 94. I was about 17. And... Uh, yeah, it's huge in the States now, too. Yeah, because I, I got some American streaming services. Uh, it is, I don't know if the MLS is prepared. I know soccer has become the number three sport. It has passed the NHL. I don't know if the MLS has passed the uh, the, um, the States, but yeah, the, it, it's pretty big in the States now. But when I was a kid, there was nothing. The national team was not that good. Um, there's only a handful of guys playing in Europe. Uh, um, you know, MLS is considered kind of a joke. Now it's like my favorite league to watch. You couldn't get into this game? Oh, man. I don't, I don't know how that's the case. This game is insane. Insanely good. I got to get some money so I can pay off my shit. Hey, thanks for donation. What kind of video games do you play? For, uh, uh, play away from the channel, like no streaming, no recording. Um, That's a good question. I, I, there's really nothing that I don't stream that I'm not playing at the time. Uh, away from the channel, I've been playing a, a Fortnite with my kid. I really enjoy that. But I have kind of, I'm on a bit of a lull with video games. Um, hey there, uh, Korean man. Uh, I play a lot of AP. I'm, I'm kind of like 
I like arcades and um, anything fast paced shooter. No, something, nothing you got to put a lot of thought into. Um, I don't like story games except for this one, but this is like a totally ex exception. Yeah, I, I I hit a wall and then I get back into it. But I like arc I like pick up and play. I'm not a big into getting real deep. I'm really I'm too stupid to play RTSs and stuff like that. Yeah, but this is an exception. Uh oh. I got some bad guys on my tail. Oh wow, I'm already fucked. Um Oh, they're already after me and close. Uh, okay, let's just get the fuck out of here. Uh, shit, let's go. They're looking for me. I got a big old price in my head. Thanks again, uh, New Jersey's. Count your days, Tommy. I'm haunting your pity ass. 90s Jersey <laughs> roadkill. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. I didn't kill that, that animal in the 90s. It was the 2000s. What's up here? Anything? Oh, it's that woman, right? I can't stand that mission. I cannot stand. It. I'll do it later. I cannot stand that mission. Should I do? I have a. Oh, I can do the. Uh, another one. Hold on a second. Uh, horse cargo, right? Twenty-five bucks. I'm K in an SMK Jay's podcast. If you call me, sending you. Love on El Kalib. I feel others keep it. <laughs> keep it Jay Pierce. <laughs> Any place to start a podcast. Um, don't do whatever I'm doing. Um, I'd sell everybody. You gotta, you gotta keep, I, although I've stopped doing this and I think eventually you can, um, keep a consistent schedule. If you don't keep a consistent schedule, it's never going to build anything. Uh, other than that, it's really a lot of luck and who you managed to, they cook up with um it's just blind luck um i i hate to say it fucking uh i really appreciate the donation by the way um billy i already had billy and i emmett ranger did i kill him i thought i flip okay put it away yeah, I think I killed him already. I think I got over her now. I ah oh, shit! I, come here, come here, come here. Sorry about that. I punched the horse. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm sorry. I hit the wrong button. Yeah, take it easy. All right. Take it. Easy. I didn't realize we had to do that. Chill. Now keep keep um keep it going and then. The worst part about it is you gotta you gotta start to work with other people and take their fans. It's it's the it's par it's very parasitic, and I managed to do it without being parasitic, and that's pretty much luck. But I never really grew to big big heights, so you gotta. Most people find somebody to start drama with and move up, unless your content's like amazingly good. I did Billy Midnight. I did Granger. It's Bell Black Bell, right? I think she's this that's a fun one too uh, okay yeah I think I got all of them now where's black bell yeah she is okay. Bitch was like, what the fuck? Yeah, I don't know. That's this it does it. Oh god.
Oh, you got to do the thing now. That's fucking bullshit. How do you do that? Ah, oh, I forgot to how to mark it. I like when. How do you do? What is wrong with me? I'm having, I'm having coordination problems. Oh. All right, there we go. Okay, that's working. I was like, bitch, what the fuck, Teddy? Thanks, Teddy. I hope you guys like a little cow. It was fun to make. <laughs> mm, nice horse. Love to steal it. Can I? Uh, oh. How do I talk to again? Uh, uh, maybe he's got to give me some. It's weird. That was strange. That was weird. <coughs> oh man, have I ever been bit by a poison spider before? No, I've never been bit by a poisonous anything that I know of. I kind of wish I was and go around. I, I didn't grow up far from Manhattan and go around like climbing the walls and shit. There's no game audio. For reals? Oh shit, I see that. Hmm. Sorry about that. Because I had a different headset, I had my regular headset. Oh, we should have said something earlier. Yeah. There you go. It's like 
Looks like was it like me or is it glowing? Let's kill it. Oh, we'll see what that bird is. Hunters. Fuck. They always draw, they never like back off. Bastards. I got a problem. Oh shit. Uh items. Let's take some of that shit. Oh! Do I have to fight back? I want to just run away. I'm not good at this game anymore. I don't know what happened. I'm gonna have to fight back, I guess. Uh, woo! Man, I had five more bucks to that. Where are they? I'm saying you. I think it did. I'm not a very good man. I gotta get that. I wanna become good again. Thanks for doing the uh, stream today. We appreciate it. Are you going to play Half Life again? I was thinking that today, yeah. Probably going to get sick of this shit. Probably. I might do more game streams this week. Looks like it's my turn time to be the bad guy on the show. Boogie had his turn and then now it's my turn. <laughs> Do I still play WoW? No, not really. I don't even think I have it installed. Maybe I do. I'm just terrible at it. I'm not very good at video games. I wish I was. I want it here too. Yeah. 
Somebody shoot my. Wrong with this guy? Hey, need a doctor? No, oh, you gotta. You gotta. All right, friend. All right, you're gonna be okay. You're gonna help me. Um, um, please. Please, do something. Uh, uh, he got shot. Get you help. Just stay alive. Okay. Okay. Take it with the doctor, you monster. The random encounters is what make this thing feel really alive, man. Stay awake. I guess somebody shot him. That's where that shot was. on me here too. Ugh. This is it. Ah, shut up. Sit him down in this chair. This is where I'll get tuberculosis or something. What happened? Just saw you fall out of the saddle. Don't worry, you're at the doctor. Thanks, friend. I appreciate it. Sure. There's also the matter of my payment. But we'll deal with that later. All right. All right. A lot of blood loss. This wound's badly infected. I'll save as much as I can, but I'll have to amputate. What? what did you say? <laughs> Try to breathe. Uh, I'll give you something for the pain. No. There you are. And I'll knock him out for a while. You did a good thing bringing him here. But now, I'd recommend moving along. <clears throat> you do not want to see this. Oh, yes, I do. That quick, huh? I was like, this is Matt Pitt. Sorry, it's come to this. That's <laughs> probably how they... This guy's done that before. No, that guy needs... <laughs> Matt Pitt at him. <laughs> Matt Pitt was in the hospital. Next thing you know, his leg is gone. Oh, poor bastard. 
Yeah. Yeah, tourniquet that shit. A doctor's a psychopath. He gets. Oh, damn. Good work, Doc. <laughs> That's probably what they did. <laughs> You've been to Mexico? When I was a kid, I was in Mexico. I was in Acapulco. Well, you're in a bad way. Miguel. I heard you can't even visit there anymore. It's like so bad. Oh, have I been to Mexico for real? I'm here. No, I don't think so. <laughs> Old medical. <laughs> it was like funny, man. <sighs> you won't believe this. I found a gold nugget the other day. Hello, oh, then lost it right after. How could I? I It's so cool, this city. It's really a work of art. Is that Bip? Okay, fella. Greetings, friend. Hello, Ken. I lost control of my horse. That's what the problem is. Oh, can I pay off my fine here? I think I'm going to need it. What do you. Hello? Hello, mister. How do you do? Hey, y'all. Hey there. Hey, y'all. Saint Denis. I could pay off my shit here, right? I right, go over there, of course. Hi. I like horses, they just shit wherever they want. Cool, a dog. I remember they didn't put animals in. GTA games until I think the last GTA game. Well, no, were there animals in Red Dead One? Uh, yeah, I think there was. Yeah, it had to be. I don't think you can do a thing like this without. Hello, Mister. Hey, partner. Hi. Hey, partner. Yeah, Monsieur Saint Denis and Saint Louis. I think I can pay off. Uh, how much money do I have? I don't even know. Uh, welcome, welcome. Hey, bounty. That's quite a sum. I hope you learned your lesson. <laughs> yeah, I got I got a big one over there in New Hanover. <laughs> so cops leave me alone. Thanks, partner. I'm gonna go with C Black Bell now. Yeah, I did something kind of stupid. I hadn't played this game in a long time. Yeah, I kind of killed like a cop blew his head out of his shoulders at close range. Uh, they don't appreciate that shit. I forgot, you kind of got to run from the cops. Hello. Let's see. Come on. Trolley.
I also like this one because they don't really prevent you from going anywhere, anywhere but Blackwater. At first, and eventually you can go there too. Steal these horses, right? Yeah. yeah, I wonder what the new GTA. I'm sure new GTA will be good. I'm more interested in. Um, the last story wasn't bad by any stretch, um, but this story was light years ahead. It was better than the first Red Dead. A lot. <laughs> There's another thing I want. Yeah, I don't have a regular. Oh well. Days. I don't care much for reminiscing. You got any friends as bounty hunters? None that spring to mind. Well, then you done led them boys here, and you none the wiser. Ah, those bounty hunters. <laughs> Knew my luck had run out sooner or sooner. Well, get inside. I'll tell them you're gone. Oh, no, no. I ain't hiding from them scalp hunters. I ain't running from them neither. And fighting? Well, if it's just me against them. That'd be a waste of time and nitroglycerin. Well, let me know what I can do. You want that Wild West story, don't you? Yes, I do. All right. Get up here quick. Now, when I give you the word, hit that. Whole place is wired. Black Bell, I got a contract here for your life or your liberty. We'd sooner it be liberty. That's mighty reasonable, mister. Come here. Let me take a look at it. Stop just there. Now, set it off. Oh, where? Ah, where am I? My shot. Oh shit. Oh. Shit, I shouldn't have saved it. Oh, what a shot. Yeah, you got them 
them scalp hunters off your back. Uh, for now. For now. So, you gonna tell me about your Wild West days? Running with Jim Boy Calloway? Little Boy Calloway? <laughs> the only running he did was away from a fight. And that's about the end of it. Well, a man's apparently a famous gunslinger. Yeah, so they say. But, uh, don't get what's famous confused with what's true. The ones of us that lived that life, we was too busy being scared for our scalp to talk to no newspaper writers or... I'm not giving any spoilers. I'm going through, like, everything slow, so just keep playing. If you get bad, be quick. Those days, they all talk about. Same as now, I guess. Only longer ago. <laughs> all right. I'm going to need your picture, too, if it ain't a trouble. No, sir, no trouble at all. Can't be worse than those awful drawings on the wanted posters. Hell, <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. Look, you stand over there and... Oh, let me get this thing ready. Uh, ready? How do you want me? Like this? Okay, got it. And I guess I'll be on my way. Here. <laughs> well, thank you, Mrs. Bell. You gonna be all right? Oh, been running for twenty years. You want to get chapter? Oh, I'm going. Know. This is like real. So I don't ideas. even two, two chapter two. Good luck. Very early. <laughs> Mission complete. Let me uh, loot these bastards. Guys in the mud. Wasn't there a weapon in here or something? Cigarettes, no, I can't. Probably. Mm. Nah, it's one of the best games I've ever seen for show. Moonshine. What's in the chest? Take it. Sword and biscuits. Canned vegetables. What else we got? Anything good? Oh, there's some ammo there, I think. Nah, biscuits. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I thought there was like a weapon here or something. I could have sworn. Oh, that's a pretty cool hat. They finally got that. Nah, that's it. Dead guy. There we go. Give me your shit. Oil gun, which can be used to improve condition. Nice. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think that's enough. Was there something in here? I ain't good in there. I can loot, I can loot this guy. Where's my... Hey, shoot the lock. Where is it? Where's the lock? Ooh, bye. Murder. Fucking witness. Can't do anything bad in this game. Is she kidnapped? I don't know. Probably let her. I don't like that guy pointing a gun at me. Piss me off. Crime reported again. Oh, fuck. Uh, unknown suspect. I like that. Those, those, those alligators? Fuck. Yeah, I think they were. Time to get away. Okay. You also could talk to the witness too, or something. Evening, partner.
Are they wolves or no, it's coyotes. Fan of coyotes. Whoa. I think. Futuristic game. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Rockstar's next game is set in the Star Wars universe. What's that over there? Boy. A good boy. Yeah. Oh shit. Is that a snake? Did I have some time in my head? 65. Yeah, maybe. Maybe not. We can still live free. We can still say we don't recognize you or answer to you. I can't spread fan on the gun. Shit. I must is the gun dirty or something? Ouch. Tell this tale. 
Yeah, and kill those guys. Do a classic manager in Boston or Chicago. New York's, I think uh, they're going multiple cities on GA, GTA. I think it's uh, Florida and um, around that area. Yeah, they're doing the whole crazy Florida thing. It's pretty. It's pretty crazy, Florida man. I should just sleep here. Full of dead guys. Rest by fire. Clean venison. Oregon, too politically, yeah. No no fun up there. Oregon's really beautiful though. It's like one of the most beautiful states, if not the. Tommy, you underrated? Thank you. To hear that from the goat. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Well, see, so yeah, that's kind of, I don't think those cities are too far from each other. I know that that's like the biggest soccer rivalry is uh, Portland, Seattle, so probably because it's close. America, one of the biggest soccer, American soccer rivals. Vancouver, Portland, Seattle, they all hate each other. Portland, Seattle, bit of Canada. It's not a bad idea, to be honest with you. It'd be really cool, actually. But it's just not an area known for crime. You know? You know? That's why Florida's probably a little better. But to see it would be nice. I have to admit. Well, yeah, it's it's it wasn't. Here's the thing about that. You're right. It is, it is a shithole for crime. Now, it, it's not. It doesn't have a history like New York and Chicago, and Florida recently. Florida's always like I don't think of gangsters when I, mean, I think of Florida. I don't think of gangland violence, but I'm sure it's a shithole now. I mean, look who's running it. Yeah. Ooh, I love that. That's so cool.
Yeah, the drug history, the you know, the Mexican gangs and South American, yeah. Portland, uh, that whole era of Pacific Northwest has recently gone to shit. I'm doing fine, Harry Kitten. Dandy. Game's going just beautiful. Yeah. Oh, what's this? There oh, we go. Looking to pass through. You must That's have taken it. a wrong turn somewhere. <laughs> Walk away, you nosy idiot. Oh. Hey, jackass, you need to leave. Let's go. Great line. Good plan, fellers. Good plan, fellers. Uh, that's pretty awesome. Good plan, fellers. Is there anything in there? Yeah. Oh, yes, there is. Plan, fellas. What do you got in there? Search it. Mm. Good plan, fellas. Shotgun shells. Then these guys got shotguns. Mm. Oh, more, some more there. Gun oil, nice. Snake oil. Ooh, some cakes for the horse. Go. Hey. I don't know. Ah, let's get the hell out of here. Yep. Hey, it's for horses. That it is. This is where I got the big old bounty. I think I got it. Do I, do I got, how do I clean my uh, maintain? Let's clean it. There you go. Backflip, zoom. Okay. Let's go with this one. Wrong one. You gotta go. Yeah. Clean this fucking tube. 
You gotta keep your guns clean. Gots to keep your guns clean. I have to, uh, I don't gotta maintain the bow. Twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? So yeah, sure. I bump. Oh, thank you, sir. <sighs> thank you. You know Emerald Ranch? Mind taking me there? God damn it. It's far sure. away. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. That horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool. Always complaining, but does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage, for me, has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit? He was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once? I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. No, it's me. I'm the husband. <laughs> well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide, too, as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, <laughs> he says. Gee, thanks. That's <laughs> Matt's leg. So, you live at Emerald Ranch then? For the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died hey, what's up, folks? I'll be moving on soon, though. Just enjoying the and shit out ranch, of this game. Well, it's a strange place. By the way, for everybody's in here, a lot of people have been asked to do an 8 Eric stream. I've been peculiarly quiet. We'll be doing an 8 Eric well, shot from the point uh, on Monday. But she never leaves the house. You Just to let you know. The window um, Matt is uh, first. No, it's not my first playthrough. Found an old saloon there. All shut down. Matt uh, has the week off, and uh, Vault will be taking his place all week. Stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Oh, we're getting close now. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please take this as my way of thanking you. <sighs> Appreciate it. <sighs> what a lousy day. Nice talking with you, ma'am. Good luck to you. You too. All the best. <laughs> No, we shouldn't call her dead horse a whore.
Commentary? Commentary is the easiest one. You don't have to have any talent. I'm not even joking. You have to have a little personality. That's it. Um, no, I wouldn't say that. Uh, it depends on how good you want to do, Teddy. Uh, Teddy. Um, and it does depend on, on what the... Obviously, if you're going to do music, um, you got to have some talent. Uh, vlogging is, is the easiest. I mean, it's not for... I'll, I'll say this. It's not for everything. You have to have a little personality, but you really don't have to have um, an abundance of talent. Um, but I will say this. The more talent you have... Oh, wait. I want that thing. The more talent you have, the um, Cause that's a really fast horse, isn't it? Can I steal that horse or saddle it or something? This guy goes and take it. Morning, Mister. Can I saddle this horse? Or something? Isn't there a way to do that? Mobile and talent, talent, <coughs> talent, ha, huh, helps. But um, you know, I mean, there's all sorts of different talents. There's editing talent, there's speaking talent, there's um, you know, uh, uh, being funny and stuff like that. Um, if you have a gimmick, you'll be gone pretty quick. Um, you have to have more a gimmick, and you probably. Yeah, but you 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 can the uh the ta you can jump from like what you call it to what you call it community community um and if you know how to make thumbnails and get people in and you're in the algorithm will make a lot of money I think can I I want to make this my secondary horse. Saddlebag. Noise. I forget how to saddle a second horse. Is there any? Is there a town I could take this thing to? And uh, it's 
it's, it's saying it's locked. Everything is locked. Well, I don't think Jake Towns traditional uh, talented is talented boxer uh, in the traditional way, and there's also like the sort of. Um, yeah, in a weird way, he is talented, like like talent of understanding how the way things work, and I don't know, I, I, them, it's more like the talent is more networking talent. Well, networking talent is not for the fans, though, that's for the individual creator. Yeah, yeah, Sal is too crazy. It's actually kind of a shame. And I mean that. Sal is nuts. Now, if I if I went to Valentine, I might get. I think if I could, I think if I brought this fucker in, I don't know. <coughs> if I kept this thing here, what? I don't know. I want to keep this horse. Isn't there another city I can go to? Where I'm not wanted. A little more like Limo. And why is everything closed? Because they're forcing me to do a mission? Well, the characters would hate St. Anthony. They make stories. They're, they don't like city folks. Yeah, look at the speed on this thing. It's good. I want to keep this horse, but everything's locked. Right, here. he's he's a du he's a Dubliner, right? Foe. He's a dub. I always thought he was a dub. The funny thing is, Arthur Morgan's a dub. Well, sort of. I mean, he moved there. So it's a narrow response to whistles and commands. Hey, I don't know if I want to. Play Domino. Good morning, Arthur. <sighs> Feels like we're back on track, more or less. Yep, money and food. Now everyone needs to keep it coming. My second horse. Yeah, the horse thing isn't open yet. I'm gonna use that all on a fuck. I don't care, I don't have that Come much. On. Let's get this thing moving. Yeah. Give him some food. Am I playing this on PC?
Yeah, you can gain and lose weight. Did you hear the MCU? It, it, it sure feels like it. I wouldn't be surprised. If I, th I think they have a bunch of fucking woke idiots working over there with no talent. So they just scour the internet. I mean, that's what I think those kids do nowadays. And they just, you know, steal. I think the I, I think Vito should probably sue them before he, they sue him. Yep. I think he almost has to. Well, maybe I hope he got a copyrighted and all that other horseshit. Hey, got some action here. Shit. Run. Grab him, boys. His cops are making a <laughs> Love having a faster horse. Oh, it's your Driscoll's. Blackwater? Oh shit. I can't go to Blackwater. Fuck. Idiot. Oh. Gotta be a better way to get there. Ain't the way to win on this fight. Get me off this horse. I'll just try to put her on mine. <laughs> Saving the women. Nice folks around here. A whole lot of 
ugly business here. Well, sir. It's all right, girl. Hi there. Already, we won't see that. Well, there's like almost like ten years between games, so you, you, you're not you're looking at another three to four, eight, three to five years for another one of these. There's also the question: of where do they go with it? They can't go in the future because now we're talking World War One gangster times. They could go in the past further back. They could make it about Dutch, but I think his character's been totally explored. Go back to the whole red Har red Harlow, yeah. Is he is he officially in the um, the Red Dead uh, lore though? Is he? Because somebody told me he's not. It's a different sort of universe, you know. I, I see. I got to do this a different way. I know that. I can't go that way. Oh, it's in Blackwater. You know what? I'm going to do that then. See what happens. Yeah, I never played that. That one I never played. Yeah, they, they, I, I think they, it's, it's kind of up in the air. Did they ever mention him? Yeah. Like by name, not reference. I think I heard a reference to Red Harlow. It sounded like the same. Tons of fan theories, yeah, as I thought. I never played that one, Red Dead Revolver. I heard it, it was more like comedic, sort of like uh, GTA. Silly. It's really in, it's in there. Nah. Can I get across there? <sighs> it's really dangerous. Found a good way to cross. Wanted dead or alive. Easy, girl. Damn that horse. Uh, 
What does he want? Is there like a... Yeah, eat some. everywhere you see Sean no I don't think so damn it <sighs> where is that little Irish best I'm not quite sure Trelawney's off trying to find out has anyone been in the black water see how things lie place is crawling with Pinkertons bounty hunters and, uh, pictures of Dutch and they had to cut out a lot I always got that feeling in that town. and that's where it's gonna remain for now I think it's mods to play this quest, if I'm not mistaken. They hang Sean, I wonder. I think he's bait. Well, they want to trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or we cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess <clears throat> we need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government or people whom the government like seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean and we'll get ourselves lost good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Okay, girl. Return to my horse. Am I going to lose this one? No, I'm gonna lose this thoroughbred. I want this Come horse on. so bad. Why did you stop? Come on. Hey, do you need to stop for something? I want. Uh. Yep. Get my boy. Let's go. Get. Let's get. Let's head up river and find this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes, south of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place. Hey, Pigma, how do I get that horse to make it mine? Just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and staying to bring it in to the, the dirt stable. with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. I don't think I got stables open York. yet. You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Push up. Come on. Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. 
Yeah, have to bring it to a stable and saddle him, right? I beat this game years ago. Look, they've stopped. Get your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing with here. So, who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skelton's boys, but I hear they're a big crew and wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Dirty. Get your knife ready. Keep your head down. Wait. Okay, let's move down. Don't cross until he's got their attention. Yeah, the brains. Hold up, he's doing his thing. Gentlemen! Gentlemen! Excuse me, dear brothers, my wife is taken ill, gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You she take the one on the left. Where is she? Let's go now. Keep down. I, I, I'm beside myself. I, I'll be here, I, I, you didn't kill him. I lose everything. Oh, calm down, mister. I, I can't. I can't. I, I'm having a fit. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's get up there. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. I think you have it from me. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Okay, lean roll those boots you got there, eh? Those are very nice. Who's the guy you got them from? Is he alive still? Mm. Come on, focus. Oh. Come on! We need to get past this son of a bitch! Shit. Jolly Jacks.
Oh, uh, where is he? Shot. You see that? <laughs> It's a Dublin accent, isn't it? Arthur. <laughs> <laughs> Arthur. You know, What's up, man? You're you know? a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do I get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know. Nothing means more to me than this gang, the bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. <clears throat> okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah, I can't wait. <clears throat> I imagine y'all missed me a lot. But fear not. The joy's back in your lives now. Where are my horses? Oh, Tomahawk. Nice. Give me your shit. Where's the other one? I bet that horse is gonzo. time. Yep. 
I'm looting. Yeah. Horse is probably fucking dead. Ah, oh, shit. Horseback. Yep. Oh wait, I, can I go back? I can go back the other horse. Yeah, I'm. Hey, oh, I can see him on the map. Man, yeah, there's a trail right there. Okay, I think I do it. Stable that horse. How much money do I have? Pay that fine off. I'm gonna get him. that guy. I need that horse. I've helped that guy before. He talks about how much better it is in New York. Another day on the move. 
Go. Go, 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 go. Do it. West Elizabeth is five dollars. Yeah. All right. Is there a, a strawberry? Hmm. Now I gotta get to a bait shop over the coast. A stable. Arthur's Horse. I think I gotta go keep doing those missions until. Uh, I hate that mission with the fucking what's his face. Roanoke Station. Yeah, I guess I might as well. That's what the preacher. Yeah. I got that horse, Nightwing. Gambling preacher, yeah. Sorry, girl. Nah, it's not my first time. It's been a really long time. Did I get him up and over? No, nah, it's not my first time. Seen so much as a fleck around here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Come on, come on, let the wolf see the rabbit. Well, good luck to you. Like another pile of shit crumbs, don't it? Let's give it some of the magic touch. <laughs> Come on now. Yeah. <sighs> Something. Anything. I'll take a cigarette butt at this point. I'm 
being nice to you, so be nice to me. Wait a damn second. Look at this. Oh, who's got gold? Who's got gold? Woo hee, I got some gold. Found me some gold. Why don't you hand it right over? Get away from me. I'm gonna kill you, son. Eighty five cents. My right, brand new small jewelry bag. Is there anything else in there? Hold on, I gotta get gold. Pick up prospect. There's anything else around here? No. Did I get it? I dig it. He's right. Ooh. Fuck out of here. How about that? You found me some gold. 
So, uh, you two know each other anyway. Don't seem like the likeliest of friends, if you don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? He can't be no real clergyman. <laughs> he committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. Uh, life is a challenge to all of us. Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much after that. <laughs> <laughs> He's a decent fella going through a bad time. Disrespect him again, and you'll find yourself in a bad time, too. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. It is a game, after all, mister. Okay. Here, look. Pile of crap. Don't laugh. Woo Damn it. Yeah. Now that's what I'm talking about. Pick one if I have one. There we go. Lucky son of a gun. This has been quite the eventful day. I reckon you're a serious bluffer. Seven, eight. Let's start this low for now. Is that it? That's all. My lord, you're born. Geez, straight flush. Gonna start small here. Yep. Wait, I got a straight flush? No, I got a straight flush draw. No, no, I don't. No, that's seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, Jack. Nah, nothing. Nah. Uh, check. Let's see then. <sighs> no way. Hmm. You're real lucky. I'll take it. Shall we just play a little more? I must say, you have a lot less stories than your friend did. Take a turn. Ah, oh, fold that shit. That's garbage. <laughs> ah. Better than nothing. Not again. Oh, I'm glad. <laughs> I check. Mm. I'll take it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Ah. Gonna start small here. Better than nothing. Ace Queen. Here, just a little. Oh, come on. I'll this race. ain't kid poker. Hmm. No. 
I'll check. Boring. Damn it. Yeah. All right, then. <sighs> yep, there's two hands. Should have seen that coming. Hard lines, partner. You worry about your own game. Now you're talking. Yeah, I'll take it. There we go, finally. I'll give you that one. Yeah, I know. Pretty pathetic. Okay, then. I reckon all in. Damn it. He's calling it. Okay, I'm going to take a pair of jacks. All right, what do we got? What's he got? Huh. Oh, he's got queens? That's not looking up, amigo. I didn't even see. Oh, jack for face king. He's going to get ugly for you all. Sneaked in at the end there. Ah. Ah, oh, no shit. Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Sit down. Oh, I'm done, friend. It's been a real education. Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where it? <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, <laughs> smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Yeah, I look kind of crazy, mister. No, you have no idea. Off him. Word. You'll keep. You stay out of it. Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch. What the hell is your problem? He's with me. How do I fucking dodge? I forget. Ooh. How do I dodge? Oh, that's it. Oh my god, you killed him. I'm gonna keep the law. Oh shit. Hey you, get back here. Hey you. you saw back there you're a dead man you understand me yep i i won't tell us so i promise <sighs> now what Where's reverend
Just a simple mistake. You can still be safe. What have you done with your foot? It appears to like this place and wants to stay. Crazy bastard! Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? Ma <sighs> Wonderful. Big water. Eh, not much. Same old, same old. Oh, shit. So cool looking. Hey. show up. You better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what Doing toxic. Just the usual. Poor bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. I've done uh, one part a couple of years ago when it first came out. He was lucky. This time. On the PS4. It's Sean walking around drunk, too. Ah, uh, Mr. Morgan. You seem better? Yeah, almost feel normal again. Uh, you were never normal, Marston. Real 
real heavy in Blackwater, Dutch. Jose, <sighs> you and Jose are everywhere, Trelawney said. All the more reason to stay well away for now. I got no intention of going back anytime soon. No, then we're not gonna be able to get a Cyrex. Nobody thinks they're a low cow. Everybody thinks they're above it. Except me. <laughs> I go in the uh in the cave. Hello. How are oh the Lord please end it. You got some speaking to do of your own. Not that old gang of yours. I said. I told you, I don't know nothing. That's what I thought. Whoa, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah, uh, who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Geld him. Oh, yeah! What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Eunuchs was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, you're kidding me, right? A court. You sick bastard! So, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, Odrisco. <laughs> I ain't no old Driscoll. Well, you sure as shit was. John, Bill, come here. This guy gets a bad deal. Home needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. You gonna pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I have to I have to use that other one. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. Damn it. Arthur! What are you doing? I gotta take that for a stone line. You sure look like one, and you smell like... God damn! You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might... I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me? Instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey, hey, if, if I got my bearings, it's over here. We don't. Yeah. What's Western entertainment, huh? I know this country. Take this yeah, Jago is good. Hopefully, it wasn't bad either. I put my like big black pecker in his him. mouth. <laughs> that was a she great scene. Was to ride with us. She was told. Well, I smell like a stall ain't been cleaned out in a month. I smell like that because you had me tied up there about as long. 
You'd be smelling worse if we'd done what some was arguing for. Granted, granted. I was in with a bad lot. I'm trying to make amends. If I can. You don't know the half. I do know Colm killed Dutch's sweetheart. And that's the man you chose to ride with. A woman killer. Well, it was after he killed his brother. And the way I understood it, the... Making excuses for the man. And his crimes. What kind of trap you leading us into, boy? I ain't. I'm trying to help. Honest. One thing goes wrong. One thing other than you smelling funny, you're the first O'Driscoll will shoot. Uh, and quit breathing on my neck. And now we go left. Yeah, I like to play. Take us up and round. Oh, Kelmer was perfect for that role. He is probably the closest to a real life like uh those are the hills head for them save your horses we gotta climb boys you know he, you all ain't that different from the old driscolls what did you just say i've been watching you all these weeks and uh you've been tied to a tree you don't know nothing about this gang yeah well i i'd say you don't know much about the old driscolls but maybe i know more about you than you know about them and I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then, how are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law. Nature. You're out for yourselves. See? This is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live. Free. Holmes a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is... Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boss, we're almost on them. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. Amen to that. Here, here. I swear, this is where he was. Shut up. Okay, now now cut left up here. We we go down the hill into the forest. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Where are those knives? weapons. Fuck it up, dude. 
guys shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now, come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you strangers, yup? And Colm O'Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. <clears throat> yes, sir. Come on, shake it off. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the three. Let's get closer. I'm gonna deal with this first floor. Okay, go to work. Uh, oh fuck. Shit. Oh fuck. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh, thank you. <sighs> Come on, Driscoll. He ain't here. You set us up. Come here! Chris Pratt. What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here! He was here, I swear! I swear! I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. How about Roger Clark? All right, then go on. He's Get played Westerns before. I won't kill you. I didn't set you up. You're lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away now. Go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. So? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Okay, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing just yet. And right you are. Shotgun. You see in the chimney. Double barrel. Maintain it. Oh, <sighs> clean it. I can go pay off my thing. Well, at least you got something. Six hundred bucks. Share yeah, three hundred. Anybody else in there?
Where are we going now? Blackwater's done. Red Dead, he's making audiobooks. Yeah, I think he's going to get paid for a long time for that. I'd like to see him get more acting jobs. But really did a great job with the character. Um, I'm sure he got typecast too. But I, I think if there was a good Hollywood Western, he probably would have a shot at it. Even if he wasn't playing... Uh, Arthur Morgan. I mean, Stephen Ogg got, you know, Walking Dead. I, I kind of threw this, I thought. You know, his uh, cousin that I knew, uh, and I knew him a lot better than I knew Roger, uh, is a school teacher now. <laughs> He's a crazy fucking guy when you're younger, and now he's a school teacher. It's funny. I didn't say he was crazy. He was kind of a hard ass. Hey, hey, let's talk about this. Ooh. Arthur, Arthur, come lend a hand here. Go ahead, oh. call your mama for a lot here. Uh, take it easy. I got lumbago. <laughs> Should have thought about that earlier. <laughs> you pathetic old You could have stepped in. I thought you had it covered. Just wait till you're old. I'll be at camp if you need me. I'm tenderfoot. Oh, you know what? I'll go sell that, uh, all that shit. Good to see you back. Grew up around a lot of future talent. Now, well, he lived in Ireland, and I said he came around because he was related to that guy. Uh, it, was, it was bizarre. And then, yeah, well, then Mike Nirenberg, he became a, um, you know, a Hollywood guy. I actually st I started talking to him again. Uh, he did a lot of work on uh, Boardwalk Empire uh, set design and stuff. So, yeah, I guess it was weird. I, 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 I really wondered. This is a weird thing. Like, um... When I joined the army, like, I couldn't believe how few, like, all we did was play in bands and stuff when I was a kid, you know? I really wanted to be a rock star. And 
stupid, but it, they did. But I mean, I did get to, you know, I can play bass, I can kind of play drums, and I can play guitar pretty well. Um, I can do solos, and I'm not a great guitar player by any stretch, but you know, I had a little talent. And everybody I knew was involved in a project like that. We were always doing it, whether they were good or not. I don't know, probably not, but everybody was around. And when I joined the army, like I, I only knew one guy that played a guitar. He was kind of awful. And I just started wondering, maybe because I grew up in New Jersey, and I don't know, it's kind of the place next to fame and fortune, and um, maybe that you know, just the location is is an advantage. And nobody really, I got the feeling the rest of the country didn't have as much access to the arts as I did. You know what I mean? It was very strange. Yeah, our band, my band was all right. Uh, it's so hard to like make it, so to speak. But there's a part of me that's glad I didn't. Um, I mean, the money would have been nice, but I, I would have been a different person, and I really don't like them. I was in a bear. Well, yeah. And in fact, I, I'll tell you what. I played right across from. Um, oh, who's the black guy in, with the metal band? I played in the same studio as they did. Um, let's enjoy ourselves. We having a party? Julie, New York. Well, yeah. Uh, what was the band? It was, it was not Life Agony. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of bands that came through there around my age, too. What was that stupid punk band from Marlboro? What scene was I in? Um, everyone. <sighs> Taking back Sunday, yeah. I didn't know those guys though. I'd, I'd, uh, they were. What I heard about them is, they were. It was kind of a boy band. Like the the got the lead singer's parents ran the project, and as soon as you they like aged at all, they got rid of you. Um, so they were kind of they were a bit of a boy punk pop band, but there's a lot of bands like that. Brand new is from New Jersey. I, was, I loved. I only they had that one hit song that I absolutely loved. They were from New Jersey. Imagine riding with them all the way from Blackwater. Keep blood in your head. Keep it. That's one of my favorite songs. Um, no, brand new from Long Island. Yes, yeah, I thought. And then, um, what was the other band from Long Island when I was there too? Those guys were around my age. Um, they came around around the same time. Uh. They had the pill album cover, like with your Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday pills on it. Right. <laughs> saves the day. Oh, no, it was Saves the Day. It wasn't Taking Back Sunday. It was Saves the Day. Glass Straw. Glass Straw was the band, yeah. They were kind of they they, we, they they got big around the time when I was losing interest. They were like the first like anti new metal group. Last draw, that was it. And and take uh, saves the day. Yeah, that's the one that the, the, the parents ran the whole thing. And then when they got big and the the lead singer got too old, then it was okay to be old in that band. You know? But they they had a lineup uh, that they just went through those guys. Everybody hated them, to be honest with you. They didn't like, they weren't considered a true garage band because they got a lot of funding. That area of Marlboro's got a lot of rich Jews. <laughs> I don't think they were Jewish though, but uh, there's a lot of money up there. Yeah, saves the day. It wasn't uh, Taking Back Sunday. I just I got them confused. Yeah, so that's, that's, that was around then. I guess some kind of a. Will you dance with me, Arthur? Sure. Of course, Dutch. Sure, but I ain't much of a dancer. Say, <laughs> Arthur, it's okay to dance. Who, which guy was accused of being a groomer? That's another thing that I'm glad I didn't make it. Because when I was young, it was okay to have like groupies and 
oh tons of sex and i really wonder like if that that would have destroyed me if uh chris conley is what is he the singer of the band which band who saves the day he was he was accused of that you know i really wonder like i mean i don't know maybe he did some fucked up shit. i don't know all right i don't know the whole story um did i watch the red bull game yes i did um yeah they ended up winning it i did i watched it in the morning Oh, Jesse, like, yeah, let's see all the other, are they really groomers, or are they just, like, banging a lot of chicks? I mean, so, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of glad that never happened. Just banging my brains out when I came out. Look, I never did, it. girl ever said no to me, that was it, Jack. I was afraid. Um, uh, so, girl said no to me, or, or that was it. I, I wasn't even going to get... Cause there were people like that when I was young that would just make up a crazy story. So accusation never said it was legit or not. Mr. Morgan. Morgan. Hello. Hello. What do you want? I'm not. I'm not quite sure. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh shave from sleep. Yeah, it's groovy bands. I mean, I did. I was actually worse when I left New Jersey. Um, but I mean, that was okay. That was part of being a young guy. You know, we used to, it sounds awful, but we used to have the Wiesbaden trifecta. You have a girlfriend in Frankfurt, mines, uh, and a Wiesbaden, and then you just kind of rotate to their houses. It's fucking, <laughs> but we're young, they're single, you know, and so are they. I never dated the, uh, they were the one, the, the guys that dated soldiers were the ones oh, always getting confused shit. as shit, and the soldier girls were, oh, um, if they were pretty, they already had boyfriends, if they weren't, or they were just okay, then, it's just like, sort of these kids now, they, they couldn't handle that, the life, they would always wake up, think they were raped, never have any memory of anything, and the guy would go on trial, and then he would get off, you know? Sure. That guy would go and try a temporary horse. I want, how do I make him add more or way more? Horseshoe overload. Ah, right there. Go hunting. I don't want to go hunting. That's a long mission, anyway. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? You went to start where? Oh, whoa, well, whoa, well, whoa, well, yeah. So, while the rest That's of where the, the Saves the Day guys were all, all from. I went to Starland. I went to, what was the one at Bur Birch Hill? And then, right next to Birch Hill was, yeah, I'm trying to remember. Well, I saw a lot of bands at Birch Hill. Uh, I got some errands to run. Birch Hill, and then the one over by Marlboro. Where are you from, Blake? You gonna take the old man in town? To take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. Yeah, he's really into it now. Do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Think oh, you from Mass? Yeah. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> Can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> Can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robbing. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to this civilization. Yeah. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. Yeah, it's kind of weird yeah, that he mentioned it. Love it. Sure, you'll see. Real civilized. <laughs> Let's go. All right. You know the way? 
I uh, I only went to Boston once and it was a few. It was only like ten years ago. It was more of a YouTube trip, to be honest with Appreciate the help. I I'm worried this one here will bolt on me too if I leave him. Sure, no problem. It's the white one over there. Not again. This way. Come on. As in Europe for freaking bands. I don't know. I never, I, I, I made it a point not to go to too many shows over here. I, I had done that part of my, I mean, I saw everybody. I saw Clutch, Limp Bizkit, Marilyn Manson, uh, Deftones, Corn. I just, I was done with it by the time I got here. I was more into women, you know what I'm saying? I just, there were so many girls, and all, they're all foreign, get it? <laughs> and, you know, after, eh, I got, it's here about a year, and then I was looking to get married. Which wasn't the smartest thing I ever did. Here, here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. Come on, let's go to Valentine. <laughs> <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother, there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart, a small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> Now those sheep, <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh no. Yeah, he used to they used to play with Clutch and uh, Neil Neil you know, Fallon. I think his name was. I was a huge or fan of them. See what we got here. Go left here, down the main street. There's always on the right. Sure, you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. 
Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. Yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at its finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're gonna do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. I imagine Paris and Valentine's So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. <laughs> no. <laughs> Bring one <coughs> parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Bringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. Shut up. Catch 33 to square after the close. This is the place now. Come on. Mm. Morning. So, what do you need? Drop a whiskey for a start. Mm. Well, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Yeah. That guy should probably steer clear of the saloon this time. Why don't you pick out a cigar? A cigar always focuses the mind, I find. What are you saying? Well, you seem a little scattered, Arthur. Trust old uncle. Let me know if you have any questions, fellers. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Wait. Mm. Hey, you're the feller who had the fight with Tommy outside the saloon? Yeah, that all got a little out of hand, but I didn't swing first. Sure, well, these things happen. And that was some good viewing. Don't reckon folk ever seen Tommy lose a fight before. Well, it's all done now. You not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. What do you reckon? The lamb or the sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Now I know what the smell is. Well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. Well, look at this. A jaw harp. What is this list of yours? I got a lot to replenish after that god-awful time in the mountains. All done. Thank you kindly. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. Here's to your good health. That's crazy. Sir. It's still there. That's nuts. <sighs> it's a funny world. You know? This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out in their new Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? Seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me. Get off of me. I've been looking. 
Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? You want to find out? You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you. Go right wait with now. Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. They hung that dog and stole a bag of flour. Can I help you, sir? I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk feather. Mid-twenties, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in 2B upstairs. Are you, uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. No trouble now, please! Okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. Bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched oh. me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, now. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Hey. Just borrowing it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. Telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up. Please. I'm begging you. All right, come on. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Jimmy Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh... Here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. 
Oh. That's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. Yo, Gummy Warm. I kill people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I'm never so... Your parents know I'm no, gay? No, 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 not, not never. I haven't told them. I think we have an understanding. Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one sense in this year old mind. Come on. Come on. You have a nice day now, sir. Today's <laughs> Trans Awareness Day. Yeah, they put that like right on Easter. Yeah, I wonder what. But that wasn't done on purpose. Oh, did I lose my, uh, I wonder if I... Wasn't... That gave me the second horse, and I think that fucked my other horse, didn't it? <sighs> I wanted that thoroughbred so bad. Turn the horse. I don't have a Tommy cam. This thing really sucks the shit out of your PC. What's a kitty cat? Thinking around here. <laughs> yeah. Fuck, I really wanted to keep that other horse. Driscoll's got designs on it. I've only got to click my fingers and this town will string you up and call it justice. You want You're done! Open the place!
This thing's slower than molasses. Yeah, I lost my horse. My good one. American standard bread. Oh, God. Ah. Guys, uh, the Irishman, how are you? It's been a long time. You know, this guy's been around forever. Hey, Ben, bud. You've been watching, you've been away for a while. It seems like you pop your head around at least once a year. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Arthur. Dutch, Miss O'Shea. Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon. I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. Cause they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust me, uh, Dark Mr. Viper. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah. Dutch. Arthur. <clears throat> What's going on? That's what you get in. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry. It's okay, and... son. Breathe. <sighs> they nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur, what? 
The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? <sighs> Yeah. <coughs> you kept up to date? Oh, thanks, man. Take that kid into town. Valentine, not strawberry. Thank you, thank you. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. You've been through it. I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side off. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting the headquarters. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Fifteen years old, honestly. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Micah knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. And then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mike. It was drink that started all this. We'll just have a cup. I think I had enough, guys. I'm gonna try to attempt to go back to sleep. Ugh. All the best, everybody. I'll do these later. We'll go through each storyline and shit. Take care. Good night.